I'm hoping from Keysight Technologies. Now, if you have purchased or just wanted to try out the Keysight x 8711 a IoT device functional test solution, this video shall assist you how to properly install the necessary software tools and components and to ensure that the whole test solution is working properly. First, download the x 8711 a install visit from the keysight.com and then go to the visit technical support and uh, go to the driver and firmware and software tab and just download the install wizard. Run the install wizard and uh, it will list down all the key software components required and also some of the key side uh, software components as well. Uh, it will list down the installed version if you have any previously installed. If not, just click on the install button. After the installation is uh, completed, it's time to install the required license for some of the components. Just click on the uh, link below here and it, will, it shall lead you to the Keysight Licensing Manager. If you have the uh, license files, you can just install it uh, from here. After you have completed the installation, here's a five checklist item for you to uh, ensure that the software that you have installed can run properly using the x 87 11 a test solution. First item, check the x 87 11 a instrument connection uh, as shown over here and uh, make sure it's connected to the PC. To get the x 87 11 a uh, visa address, just open up the Keysight Connection Expert and uh, you shall see the visa address over here. And to get the COM port number from the uh, PC, just go to the Device Manager and then under the Ports uh, segment as shown over here. The next few checklist items shall be on the Keysight Test Automation Platform software or tab. On the tab software, go to the settings and then bench then instruments and under the uh, this setting choose the required visa address and also the uh, COM port number for this example is uh, 75. Checklist number four to ensure that we have the correct plugin and license installed go to the package manager and under the packages, you can see that uh, we have the PLE and also the uh, WLAN plugin with the correct licenses installed. Last but not least, open up the required test plan. And uh, for this example, we are going to use the uh, PLE signaling test, test plan. Then hit the run button. And bear in mind that uh, a additional 180 seconds, about three minutes additional runtime is required if you are running this uh, test plan on your PC for the first time. Thank you for watching. For more information of, on the X8711A test solution, please do visit our keysight.com website.